to check the rider's back with the bike on a stand and the rear wheel off the ground, measure from the top back corner of the swing arm to a solid point as close to the arc of the rear axle as possible. This is measurement A. Now set the bike on level ground, have the rider with gear on sit in a natural riding position as though they are riding through the pit. Balance the bike with no brakes held and not in gear. Push down on the rear and let the shock settle. Measure from the same two points. This is measurement B. Subtract measurement B from measurement A to get your rider sag. Adjust spring preload as necessary to get the rider sag correct. Now set the bike on level ground. Not in gear, balance it under its own weight and bounce the shock up and down a couple of times. Measure from the same two points. This is measurement C. Subtract measurement C from measurement A to get the free sag. When the rider sag is set correctly, the free sag should be between 25 and 45 millimeters. This tells us that the rear spring rate is correct.